Angers and Bordeaux went head-to-head -head in what was perhaps, surprisingly, a relegation six-pointer with three games of the season remaining. The hosts had fallen into danger after a shocking run of form that had seen them pick up just one win since late January and continued last time out as they fell 2-0 away at Monaco. Visitors were in a worse predicament though, four points behind Saint-Étienne in the relegation playoff spot and running out of time to save their top flight status after holding out for 75 minutes against Nice last week but eventually losing out to an Andy Delors winner. David Guillaume watching on anxiously. He was right to be anxious. Just six minutes into the game, a fairly innocuous looking through ball turned into a huge chance as Benoit Costil got caught in two minds, rushing out, retreating, but too late. And Mohamed Ali Cho able to turn into an empty net. A perfect pass through from Matias Pereira Lage, and the teenager keeping his cool. A shocking start for Costil and Bordeaux. Then later in the first period, a free kick from the right. Batista Mendy rising highest to double the lead. A perfect delivery from Angelo Fulgini and a first league goal of the 34th attempt for the 22-year-old. So 2-0 at half-time. Exactly where Angers wanted to be, but Bordeaux's slim chances of survival getting narrower by the second. Sco had lost seven of their last ten home Liga Uber Eats games, however, perhaps a glimmer of hope for Les Girondins. Into the second half and a triple change for Guillaume, one of which was the introduction of Sekou Mara. And the teenager would make an instant impact. Corner from the left. Headed home by Mara. And the deficit halved. A bit of handbags after. And a yellow card for the goal scorer. But a potentially huge moment in Bordeaux's fight to survive. Seconds later, they were back on the attack. Mara laying it off, but the ball given away. No foul, said the referee. And Angers counter-attacked. Suleiman Dumbia nicking in front of Enoch Quateng. Laying it off to Cho. And the goal scorer finding Stefan Bauken in the middle. The striker turning home with a back heel of sorts. Bordeaux looking back in deep trouble. Close to offside, but the goal given. And Bordeaux's hopes dashed within two minutes. And Sko would apply salt to the wound late on. A long ball forward finding Ishmael Traore, who in turn found Pereira Lage in the middle. Creator of the opener applying the finishing touch to a 4-1 victory. A neat finish in the 90th minute. Portuguese midfielder grabbing his third goal of the season. Angers now all but mathematically safe. Bordeaux dropped to the bottom of the table and could have their relegation confirmed if Saint-Étienne win on Wednesday.